Once upon a time, in a serene village nestled amidst rolling hills and lush green forests, there lived a young and curious lad named Kento. Kento was known for his kind heart and inquisitive nature, always seeking wisdom and guidance from the village elders. One day, as he wandered deep into the woods, Kento stumbled upon an ancient temple, its wooden structure weathered by time. This temple was rumored to be the abode of three enigmatic sages who were known for their profound wisdom and spiritual powers. Eager to learn from these sages, Kento decided to seek their counsel. He approached the temple with awe, and upon entering, he found the three sages seated in meditation. Their faces emanated a sense of tranquility, and their eyes seemed to hold the secrets of the universe. Kento bowed respectfully and sought their guidance on the path to enlightenment. The first sage, named Master Renzo, was a tall and imposing figure. He had a commanding presence and was known for his knowledge of ancient scriptures and profound teachings. Kento, feeling drawn to him, shared his most intimate secrets, hoping to gain insights into life's mysteries. Master Renzo listened intently but remained silent, offering no words of wisdom. As Kento finished speaking, the sage opened his eyes and a knowing smile crept across his face. He said, Dear child, Secrets are like delicate flowers in a garden. Share them only with those who will cherish and protect them. Guard your heart, for not all who seem wise are worthy of your trust. Somewhat puzzled, Kento thanked Master Renzo for his advice and moved on to the second sage, Master Hana, a gentle and wise woman. Master Hana was known for her ability to understand the emotions of others and offer guidance in matters of the heart. Kento felt a warm connection with Master Haina and revealed his deepest desires and dreams, seeking her counsel on finding true happiness. The sage listened with compassion, her eyes reflecting the empathy she felt. When Kento finished, she softly spoke. Child, secrets are like a stream flowing through the woods. They have a way of reaching unexpected places. Be mindful of whom you share your innermost dreams with, for not all will share in your joy. Grateful for her insight, Kento took Master Hana's words to heart and approached the third sage, Master Taro, a seemingly ordinary man of humble demeanor. Yet, he was known for his extraordinary ability to see through the illusions of the world. Intrigued, Kento opened up to Master Taro, sharing his fears and vulnerabilities hoping to find solace and strength. Master Taro listened attentively, his eyes radiating an aura of profound understanding. When Kento fell silent, the sage spoke softly. Child, secrets are like whispers in the wind. They can be carried far and wide. Be discerning, for not all who listen have pure intentions. Bewildered by the advice of the three sages, Kento pondered their words as he made his way back to the village. He realized that though the sages appeared wise and trustworthy, their counsel was a reminder that not everyone could be entrusted with one's innermost secrets. As the days passed, Kento continued to explore the realms of wisdom and enlightenment. Along his journey, he met a wise old woman named Mi, who was known for her deep understanding of human nature. He shared with her the advice of the three sages and sought her guidance on whom he should trust. Mi smiled gently and said, Dear Kento, the three sages have shared valuable lessons. Master Renza reminded you to choose your confidants wisely, as not all who seem wise can be trusted. Master Hana cautioned you to protect your dreams and aspirations from those who may not support you wholeheartedly, and Master Taro warned you against sharing your vulnerabilities with those who may exploit them. But how can I discern who to trust? asked Kento, feeling a sense of vulnerability. Me replied, trust is earned, not given freely. Observe the character of those around you, and let time reveal their true intentions. Share your secrets with those who have proven themselves trustworthy, compassionate, and supportive. Remember, dear Kento, that true wisdom lies not only in seeking advice, but also in discerning whose advice to follow. With newfound clarity, Kento embraced the wisdom of May and continued his quest for enlightenment. 
He learned to guard his heart, share his dreams with the worthy, and confide in those who proved themselves deserving of his trust. As he walked his path with greater discernment, Kento grew into a wise and respected elder, carrying the valuable teachings of the three sages in his heart forever. And thus, his journey towards enlightenment continued, guided by the profound lessons learned from the powerful Zen story of never sharing secrets with just anyone.